Hi, welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Tonight for dinner, we're going to have a one pot chicken fajita pasta. This is really easy and delicious and you can serve it with a salad and some garlic bread and you'll have a full meal. The amounts of the ingredients that you're going to need to make this dish can be found in the information box below. You can find it on the website or the Roku channel. This is what you're going to need. You'll need some boneless, skinless chicken breast that you've cubed, some olive oil, taco seasoning mix, and you can either use homemade, and I'll put a link to that below in the information box, or you can use um, like Old El Paso or something like that that comes in the envelope. Chopped onion, chopped bell pepper, salt, rotel, chopped garlic, chicken broth, heavy cream, and ZD pasta. The first thing I'm going to do is put about half of my taco seasoning mix on my chicken and mix it up real well, make sure the chicken is coated. So I'm just going to do that. And I'm going to make this in my rock crock, which is um, something that you can get from Pampered Chef. Um, you can do it in a skillet, but I prefer to do it in that since I have it available. So I'm going to just make sure this is all mixed up, then I'm going to go over to the stove and we're going to start cooking. I'm going to add about a tablespoon of olive oil to my rock crock. And I'm going to add my chicken. I'm just going to spread this out and I'm going to let it start cooking and browning. And when that's done, I'll come back and show you the next step. My chicken is all ready, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and remove it to this plate and then I will move on to the next step. I'm going to add another tablespoon of olive oil. And add my onions and my green pepper. <laughs> and we're just gonna cook these until they're slightly blackened. I'm also going to add the reserved taco seasoning mix to the vegetables. I'm going to cook them till they're softened. After they're softened, I'm going to add the garlic and let it cook for about 30 seconds. This is all done, so now I'm going to remove the vegetables to the plate with the chicken. To the same pan, I've added the chicken broth, the cream, the rotel, the pasta, and the salt. I'm going to bring it to a boil, then I'm going to cover it, reduce the heat, and let it cook for 15 minutes. My pasta is done. It's been cooking for about 15 minutes, and now what I'm going to do is add back the chicken and the vegetables. Just going to stir this all together and let the chicken and the onions and uh, green peppers heat through and then it'll be time to serve. So here is my pasta all done and now I'm going to put some on a plate and show you what it looks like served. And this is optional and it's not really even in the recipe, but I thought it would be good. I'm just going to sprinkle some uh, Mexican cheese. It's just that four cheese blend on top. So here's my one pot chicken fajita pasta. I hope you enjoy it.